Yo, verse, what's up with all this Henny? Yo, verse, what's up with all this Henny? And the day has come. Hello everybody, all my friends around the world, audio friends. Guys, my coffee's with me. It's time for another YouTube video. My name is Paul. Welcome back to my studio, Warsaw Poland. Today, guys, we're gonna actually talk about two topics at once. I already talked about these topics. The first one is that I almost uninstalled every Waves product that I owned. You're gonna find a vid about it too, yes. I'm kind of against Waves policies and I don't want to use their product simply. That's my right as a customer. But there's one thing I'm still using and it's still there because I was not able to replace it. This thing is called Clarity VX and it's a quite an amazing denoiser based on machine learning. This algorithm is capable of doing some kind of wonders even, especially, for example, when um, denoising dialogues from a documentary uh, cinema, which I do all the time. The second part of the vid is that Aiken Digital has just released their new algorithm for Extract Dialogue version 1.5. I also made a vid about Aiken products. You're gonna also find it here. And I was kind of shocked how well the algorithms of Aiken are being developed. And something tells me that newest version of Extract Dialog might replace my Clarity VX for good. And that's what we're gonna see today on two examples. I've got two sound examples. Is Waves Clarity the only Waves plugin standing about to go down? Let's find out. I have to tell you that already the previous versions of Extract Dialog by Aiken were very, very promising, but they weren't as good as Waves Clarity VX, that's for sure. Of course, you may also point out that I should mention CDAR audio tools. Yes, of course, they are very good, though the price point of these, well, you know what I mean. So let's say this competition is between Waves and, and Aiken, as tools accessible for every wallet. Let's say, guys. And guys, this is the today's session. Two audio examples. We're gonna treat them both with Waves and Aiken. Waves and Aiken. I'm gonna play them to you as they are. And today I'm starting here because I'm gonna move around the studio, actually. Today is the first episode of my new mini-series. Let's call it, I'm going to simply call it Let's Produce, and that's going to be a full tutorial of producing a... Yo, what you doing over there, man? Come get this, come help me with this shit. Yo, I'm coming, man. Hold on, give me five minutes. I'm taking a piss. Yo, first, what's up with all this Henny? I don't and know, And Jen, man. where's the water? I'm a little, live a little. I need to be hydrated. Yo, 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 look, look. Yeah, so the first one is my voice with some heavy traffic. Uh, that I edit up from uh, soundsnap.com and the second one is a crazy dialogue I found on <laughs> soundsnap.com uh, plus a blender machine or something. So I've got different voices with different tone characters so probably it's going to be even more difficult for the machine um, to detect the dialogue and preserve it. And guys, we're going to start the test with Clarity VX. This is the plugin. This is the dialogue. And today I'm starting here because I'm going to move around the studio. Today is the first episode of my new mini series. Let's call it, I'm going to simply call it Let's Produce. And that's going to be a full tutorial of producing a. And today I'm starting here because I'm going to move around the studio. Today is the first episode of my new mini series. Yes, that's my voice, reconstructed, pres preserved by Clarity VX Pro. Shall we tweak anything in advanced controls here? 
And today I'm starting here because I'm going to move around the studio, actually. Today is the first episode of my new mini-series. Let's call it, I'm going to simply call it Let's Produce, and that's going to be a full tutorial of producing a and today I'm starting here because I'm going to move around the studio, actually. Today is the first episode of my new mini-series. Let's call it, I'm going to simply call it Let's Produce, and that's going to be a full tutorial. No, it's all good. I think we're actually there. Mm, process amount is 100. Ambience gate, I don't need this. Reflections. That's the waves uh, result. Very easy to achieve, like, really Usually it's enough to simply mm, twist one knob. And here comes a con digital. The interface is exactly the same, but... And today I'm starting here because I'm going to move around the studio, actually. Today is the first... I told you episode in the vid you. about Aiken that isotope guys should be afraid of them and Waves Clarity should be absolutely afraid of this. After a couple of seconds of listening, I already know that it's probably the same good, at least, but let's tweak it more. And today I'm starting here because I'm going to move around the studio, actually. Today is the first episode of my new mini-series. Let's call it, I'm going to simply call it Let's Produce, and that's going to be a full tutorial of producing a... And today I'm starting here because I'm going to move around the studio, actually. Today is the first episode of my new mini-series. Let's call it, I'm going to simply call it Let's Produce, and that's... Yeah, so I had to make a couple of additional tweaks, like sensitivity increased, and there's three-band sensitivity uh, control here. Mm, but, yeah, it like, took me five seconds, and I'm there, and, and should I already compare it against waves maybe and today i'm starting here because i'm gonna move around the studio actually today is the first episode of my new mini series let's call it i'm gonna simply call it let's produce and that's gonna be a full tutorial of producing a i would even say that the the, the base of my voice like the lower mid register where my throat uh, uh, is working it's more natural, better preserved with Aiken. I'm going to maybe take a shorter snippet and I'm only going to listen to this. And today I'm starting here because I'm going to move around the studio. And today I'm starting here because I'm going to move around the studio. And today I'm starting here because I'm going to move around the studio. And today I'm starting here because I'm going to move around the studio. So there's kind of a very gentle noise somewhere around like three kilohertz with Aiken, but the general base of my voice is more natural. It's preserved a bit better, but you know what? These are nuances, like these are absolute nuances, and I can tell you that they are the same good. And my first, like, initial verdict is that I can replace Waves Clarity VX with Aiken already. Like, it's done. Mm, what if I decide, like, to make and it, today? like, f half of it? And today I'm starting here because I'm going to... And today I'm starting here because I'm going to move around the studio, actually. Today is the first episode... They are absolutely almost identical, and I would say that uh, Waves is a tiny bit better in the higher register, while Aiken is tiny bit, like 1% better in the lower register, but they are virtually the same efficient. And yes, this is a cool news, because I'm going to stop using Waves for good. But to make really sure whether this verdict is certain, let's take the second uh, portion of dialogue. Yo, what you doing over there, man? Come get this, come help me with this shit. Yo, I'm coming, man. Hold on, give me five minutes. I'm taking a piss. Yo, first, what's up with all this Kenny? 
I don't in know. In Jen, where's the water? I don't know. The river, no. Yeah, this time, uh, algorithm number one is going to work better because I've got a couple of voices and this one is dedicated to work with secondary speech with multiple voices at once. So I'm going to leave it like here. Uh, I'm not going to tweak it also any additionally. I don't need this. Yo, what you doing over there, man? Come get this, come help me with this shit. Yo, I'm coming, man. Hold on, give me five minutes. I'm taking a piss. Yo, first, what's up with all this Henny? I don't hey, know. Hey, Jen, where's the water? I don't know. I need to be hydrated. Yo, 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 look, look. Yes. Like, this is almost the same thing. Like, the differences are completely minor. But you know what? Okay, let's make segments again. And let's listen in segments. Yo, what you doing over there, man? Come get this. Come help me with this shit, yo. Yo, what you doing over there, man? Come get this. Come help me with this shit, yo. Aiken this time didn't leave any traces of noise in the highs, and it preserved the highs better than waves. Kenneth, you taking a piss? Yo, first, what's up with all this Henny? Kenneth, you taking a piss? Yo, first, what's up with all this Henny? Yes, the lady's voice is more natural, less synthesized with Aiken. Yo, first, what's up with all this Henny? Yo, first, what's up? Yo, first, what's up? Yo, first, what's up with all this Henny? Yo, first, what's up with all this Henny? Just a tiny bit. I hope you can hear that, especially in this second part. What's up with all this Henny? Yeah, when I'm taking a short portion, he has to recalculate somehow, both of them. But you know what I mean. I hope you can hear it. And the last part. I need to be hydrated. And the day has come. Clarity VX is no longer the one and only for heavy denoising. Guys, no mentioning Cedar audio tools, remember? Uh, wow. <laughs> There's one more thing to mm, check. Uh, the problem with... I'm going to disable all these disabled tracks. The problem with Waves is also it's an extreme CPU hog, like the real pain, uh, this thing. I'm going to maybe only mm, put it on mute. Like, you're not going to hear it. You're going to observe only my mm, CPU usage meter, which is here. And I'm going to duplicate as many as possible instances of waves until my mm, CPU get choked. And today I'm starting here because I move around. Dude. Good, we are at 15. If I decide to make it 16, No. Yes. I've got drops here, definitely. But I'm good having 15. Yes, 15 instances of waves is the verdict. Now, I'm going to disable this. I'm going to enable Aiken. Guys. Yes, that's the result. 118 tracks versus 15 tracks of Clarity VX. Guys, I know everything and I'm ready to sum the things up. We're living in truly remarkable times, guys, and there's never enough saying it out loud. What it means for me today, it means that I can quit all waves plugins finally because i have found my last alternative which is Aiken extract dialog if you haven't tried it you have to try it if you're working with a, a film post commercial post whatever you do this is really the tool that's gonna replace clarity vx probably is gonna also replace cedar audio and cedar audio people already know it and i have to tell you guys that I'm going to keep my eye on Aiken Digital from now on really, really carefully. These guys deliver amazing stuff. There's more of it. And if this is the way they work 
on their algorithms, if this is the way they optimize them, that's the future. I'm sure of it. And well, it's a very draw situation right now for me between between them and, for example, Isotope RX, which you know already from one of my vids. And also, it's a draw towards um, extra dialogue um, on this denoising thing. And one more thing, I'm kind of sure that Aiken is going to develop it more. I cannot be so sure about it with Waves. I'm not gonna wait uh, for Waves to come up with something next, but I am going to look forward to any further Aiken digital releases because I do believe they are somehow creating the future and I can't even predict what they're gonna drop in a year or two years. I'm thrilled to live up to that time. <laughs> and that's it for today, guys. I hope you liked it. I hope you're gonna comment it all down below. And I hope to hear you very, very soon. Take care.